Ooh. Oh, you gave me such a fright. That cat, he looks familiar. Do you know him? Is that you? Oh, yes, yes, it is. Ever so silky, aren't you? Then that must mean Stella, is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events. And is that your boat over there at sea? You've come to rest me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time, I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can bet on that. How do people think they know me, but they don't know me? Like, you don't know me. <laughs> Let's get going, then. Oh, it's a... <laughs> you have some lessons to go through. Whoa! D ah! <laughs> <laughs> I do this all the time. And we're going to swim my stream. Okay, never mind. It's really not fair that you're not swimming. You're rolling on that light. This is not fair. Ooh, does this mean I can go over here? Without going all the way over there? Nope, never mind. <laughs> Why am I swimming backwards? <laughs> no. Okay, there we go. All right, let's go back to where, over here. Where'd they go? <laughs> Hi to you too. Where did they go? Let's see. Do you still hate me? Yes, <laughs> we're not friends. Cody, did he go all the way back to my boat? Yep. All right, let's see who this person is. You're going on my boat and you don't even know who I am. I don't even know who you are, sir. Over here, little one. Oh, Stella. All this air, all this open space. Yes, I feel I can grow quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm flowering already. Wait, who are you? Is that a snake? It is. Aw. What a feeling. Thank you, Stella. Cute. The more the merrier. Where is she going? Now about that garden. <laughs> oh Stella, don't you think about your boat feels a little don't you think your boat feels a little sad? Well it sure could use some greenery. So that's not a so Chris. <laughs> I cannot read. <laughs> As an added bonus, a small golden, golden, wow, <laughs> a small garden can serve as a nice <laughs> classroom. I've been thinking about teaching thing, this teaching thing for a while. It will be called caring for plants from A to Z. <laughs> hmm, yeah, it doesn't ring <laughs> as good <laughs> once said out loud. Maybe I need to work on the name some more. Nature class. Okay. What's this? Build a garden. Oh, her name is Summer. Okay. Summer asked me if I could add a garden to the boat. She wants to use it as a classroom to teach me about gardening. Okay. And woo! What time is it? Okay, don't make the same mistake. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Because me and ringing this bell, I can see that's going to be horrible. Let's see. Ooh, people are watching Sailor Moon? Okay, now. Okay, garden. Where should we put you? Guess we can... Hmm. I don't know. Should we put the garden here? 
I guess we can put the garden here. Yeah, let's do that. Looks good. Never mind. <laughs> what a wonderful little garden. You really outdid yourself, Sala. Well then, that makes us just about ready to start the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in those pots. It'll be important. Okay. Hmm. Ah, yes, carrots. I was wondering where I was going to put these things. For first lesson, we'll start with something I've been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules, as you probably have noticed already. You've all- no! <laughs> That was weird! <laughs> Why did you come out like that? <laughs> I've always been a preacher for love towards all living beings. For you see, a garden is a vessel of our love, a mirror we hold to ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Mm -hmm. Back on my island, when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. And as I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Through trial and error, I've managed to write a little song. The plants seem to react particularly well to it. I want to further test that observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing that piece of that piece to your crops. Water it first, I guess. I don't. Hmm. She said hold F. There we go. A S S A A S S S A A S S S W W A S S W I'm <laughs> really concentrating. <laughs> Cute. Wait, was Daffodil <laughs> singing along and I didn't notice because I was too concentrating? It's hilarious. <laughs> Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you? No, I didn't because I was so concentrating on getting this. This is why I sucked at Guitar Hero. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Isn't that fabulous? As I suspected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much. Vividly. Well, I'll make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows, other passengers might know how to play some music too. They may help. 
if in a good enough mood. Speaking of which, in all of the commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. The strange coin has been tickling me since I've arrived here. I'm relieved that it's not one of those pollen allergies again. Ah. Summer is really nice. Hmm. Hold on one second. All right. Oh, yeah. All of us are pretty sleepy. <laughs> Let's see. It is. Wing. Hmm. I feel like we're. Wait. Did I hit Z? Yeah, I did. <laughs> it's like, whoa, it's, what's going on? Aww. Looks like she's still awake, though. Summer, what's going on? Let's see, what is her mood? She is okay, I guess. She's not hungry. It's time to ring the bell. Yes, you did good. Now we've got a real boat going and you'll have to take care of these new passengers now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But believe all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed it by now, but this Sleeping in the guest room is not ideal scenario for any of us, especially since it's getting crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. You've been terrific up to this point, and it would be terribly rude of me to beg you for anything, but I think it's time for me to have a space of my own. A little nice house, unpretentious, but sophisticated, with a cozy vibe. Again, me, Stella, same. <laughs> A space in which I could read and unwind, far from the turmoil of the deck. Oddly enough, I'd seed something with an alplane flare. Interesting. See, even I can be filled with nostalgic sometimes. Again, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. Okay. Yes, Summer. Stella, I didn't want to disturb you with this, but for the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams. They were of a giant snake and full of menacing wreaths and rotten fruit. And since joining you and your crew, well, they've gotten much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea, or maybe the mystical energies of the Everlight. Anyway, I'm now convinced my dreams have visions. And furthermore, I think it might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. Who? I've been looking at the map in your cabin. My eyes kept being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. Okay. Wait, our friendship went down? Has been having unsettling dreams. Okay. Good morning. Oh no, he's hungry. Okay, let me go make some food really quick. Uh, I feel like he would like fish. 
let's make him some fish. So we're going to make him some fish and then we're, you know what, I should have just went on our voyage first. Why did I do this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lori. Okay, I can see why this game would be super addicting because I'm already like, this is fun. I can do so many things. You have to take care of people and all that jazz. Now I have to build a house with it. <laughs> Glenn. Glenn, me, same. I feel like I'm going to say this throughout the whole situation, but yeah, I really do feel like I'm Gwen. I do like fruits, though, so I think that's the only difference. Uh, we're almost done. We're almost done. I need to eat some dinner. It is almost 9 Eastern Standard Time. How do I feel like I've been kind of streaming for longer than two hours. Well, it's almost on three. Okay. The sights here, the sea, the sun, the breeze on my skin. It just feels so right. I'm happy to be aboard this ship with you, my niece. Oh, I wish your Aunt Viv could see you. So, Aunt... So, are you my uncle on my mom or dad's side? <laughs> Running your own ship, helping out these stranded souls. It really warms the heart. I'm glad you picked me up on that island. And I'll try and make myself least cumbersome. This book, except for food. I'll never stop asking for delicious meals. Speaking of delicious meals, I know you're hungry. Yep. Give. I just love food. <laughs> Keep them coming. I can't get enough of it. Good. I think he should be good now. Yes. Um, then we need to go to this place that's been giving summer dreams. Um, okay, there it is. Here? I'm assuming this is where she wants us to go. Hopefully. Okay. Gwen's Lodge. A storm. Let's try and catch some lightning. Remember, your Everlight will protect you. What did you say? Yes. That's the spirit. Just stand by and catch each hit. Oh god. How do you catch him again? I forget! Okay. Yeah! Yes. 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 I can see why this would be fun on the Switch, actually. I wish I did have the big daddy switch. I think that would be my next investment. Oh, 
We done? We. This cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old cot? No, on Waverly, probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friends. Of course, Sprouton. Yes, ring. I took a look at your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose, but you know what can make it even greater? More plans, bigger buildings, better pencils. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm sure Albert at Albert Shipyard could help you out. True, but we're going on to another destination. Hopefully this is a thing that she marked. Don't know if it is or not. Let me just go. <laughs> you probably won't have access to it yet. I think this is what she marked. Yeah, this is the only thing I can think of that she would have marked. Oh, the Evador. Oh, that's where I get more supplies. Okay. Alt Harbor. More resources. Should be almost there. I need to check in with the rest of them to see. Yes? There seems to be quite a few new faces aboard. I like it, don't get me wrong. I just don't want you to forget about your old uncle. You know me, I'm Mr. Personality. I can get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just don't think I'll have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry. I'll be all right. Sorry if I even brought it up. I'm just gonna stand on the edge of the boat and take it. <laughs> my wonder, you know? Hopefully no basil flag in my throat. That's no fun. But you're a toad. <laughs> <laughs> you should like ducks, no? Yes, maybe. Alright. Um Stella, my stomach is rubbing. Would you have anything to nibble on? Um, I have some berries. Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. <laughs> Perfect. Um... Hmm, so we came here. Was this where we were supposed to go? Let me check something. I think this is the only place she marked off. I don't see anything else, so it had to be here. Let's see. Hey, 
I came here to cut down trees, but I forgot my axe. I'm not going to start using someone else's axe. That would be strange. I like the way my axe feels. So sturdy and it calms me. Oh, I miss that axe. I've been passing the time by writing letters and throwing some in the water. <laughs> I've been writing poetry. It's not very good, but I'm getting better. Hopefully no one finds my terrible poetry. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Hi, Julia. Oh, we got some berries. Oh, I forgot how to dive. How do I dive? Dive! Hmm. How do I dive? Is it S? I felt like it was S. No, that's toggle. I thought it was X. There you go. Okay. It was the down button. <laughs> A valuable ring. All right. We got a valuable ring. I don't know what it's for, but we'll keep it. nothing much here okay so this may not have been the place where we were supposed to go all right so let's uh, yes Too dark to navigate. Okay. All right. So we'll just go to sleep until the morning and figure it out. It may have been the one in the cutoff area. Hmm. I'm going to figure this out. swore it was over here, but I'm a, she says it may be here. So let's try. I can't think of anything but food. Let's see. 
make some food. Um, can't remember. I gave her coffee last time. Let's see. Mmm, they're almost out of coffee. I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow, no hate, no relief, nothing. I don't, it didn't really matter to me. But that mattered to you. You spent three days crying in auntie's room. I thought you three sisters. I bought you three sisters and gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mom was appalled, but she felt better. I've long wondered why you were so sad, and the best I could come up with is that you were sad in my stead, feeling things I couldn't feel for myself. Wait, come back! <laughs> Let me give you food. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> and you don't like berries. Oh, God. <laughs> Let's make her some popcorn. <laughs> okay. Even though it's her favorite food, she doesn't want to eat it. Okay. I love comfort food so damn much. Okay. Alright, she's eating a meal she likes. <laughs> she doesn't like him banging. Oh god. Ah, <sighs> she still has unsettling dreams. is hungry. Ooh, you know what? We should probably cook some, well, we should probably catch some more fish. Let's see. Oh, we caught a message in a bottle, yay. Hmm, wonder if we can read them. We caught a cod. Awesome. She seems like she's good. Everybody doesn't like the same thing twice. So if I give everybody the same thing on the same days, it should be fine. <laughs> I don't. I'm going to make another popcorn. 
I think I, he already ate today. He's hungry. <laughs> Good. Everybody's nice and fed now. We are still on our way to the other place. Let's see. Oh. Maybe we should set our destination here. Is this where it is? Hmm. Visit the spot Summer has marked on the map. It has a vision of a great snake in the middle of the sea. It made her very restless. We should visit a spot she marked as soon as possible. A snake in the sea. Is she talking about this quartz thing? Oh God, we gotta go all the way back there. <laughs> well, I guess we can fish while we wait. I'm assuming that's what she was talking about. I don't know. I think we are getting low on fish. We're also getting low on berries and other stuff, so I don't even think we have that much corn either. Cool. Herring. Might also get some more lightning today. <laughs> oh perfect cool. I think we have a, a lot of empty bottles though another herring yeah, fishing is relaxing. Even an animal crossing is super relaxing, so I'm not surprised that this is relaxing as well. <laughs> as long as my stuff doesn't break. At least I don't have to get crafts in order to remake my rod. It just snaps. Where are they? 
How do I get back on the boat? Hmm. Getting these glow, these, the green ones are hard to get. I think we're good now. Yes? Yeah, we're good now. Hmm. Could have did better, for sure. Let me see something. different things. I think we should be good now though. Ah. Okay. All right, so we got some fish. So that's good. Still traveling, so we are going to wait. Oh, we can't. Okay. Never mind. can't go to sleep because I think we're close to the place that we need to be. Yeah, I think Summer feels it too. I thought it might be the dragon. I guess it's inevitable that it would be here. Follow me always, even in this world. Our destinies, well, they are in a trine, aren't they? Still, for all the harm that it has done me, it looks quite in pain, doesn't it? The rocks on its back to seem oozing corruption. Perhaps chipping away at them will soothe them? Go ahead, Stella. All creatures deserve love and care. Do what you do best. What am I supposed to do? Oh, it's over here. Woo! Oh, dang it. How am I supposed to go over to the other side? Okay. 
Let me wait for it. Snigger snaps. Cool. Let me wait. Okay. Looks like it's dead. Let me get on one of these things. Hmm. Ah, oh, sugar snaps. <laughs> Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I got really quiet there. <laughs> Incredible. It looks released, doesn't it? Kind of, yes. Still scary, though. I wonder what that means. If we're ever to cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. However, I might feel about it. For now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. Mm. Good. Has witnessed dragons from her past. Maybe she needs a hug? Not right now, please. Okay. All right. Let's... It's too dark to navigate. Oh, dang it. <laughs> okay. Well, that was exciting. <laughs> Let's go to sleep. And then we'll head over to the shipyard to get some upgrades.